The Daily Code Snippet. This week, we look at how to add video and audio. I will date myself, but when I first learned how to code in HTML and CSS, HTML5 was in its infancy. Back then, most video content was Adobe Flash, and a transition was occurring towards the use of more modern video formats. Flash was still an important fallback format. This year, Flash support has finally been completely severed, and it has been on its way out for several years since Steve Jobs criticized it and stopped supporting Flash content on Apple products. Flash and a later product, Silverlight, that is also now obsolete, had compatibility, security, and accessibility issues. Web developers searched for a native solution, and now with HTML5, we have the video and audio elements. Understand that there are also services that you can purchase that will host your videos and audio content that will provide you embed links that will make the process easier and help you avoid the difficulties associated with trying to host video and audio content yourself. These services have included SoundCloud, YouTube, and Vimeo. Just like with images, there are multiple video and audio formats. We will discuss these first in the next video so you understand what formats are appropriate for what you are doing. Video file formats consist of a video container and a video codec. The container holds the compressed video coded data alongside its audio coded data. The container also has all the metadata about the file. In the video codec, which comes from encode slash decode, is the program that can decode the compressed data. The pairing of different container formats and codecs influence what programs and devices are compatible with the file. Typically, the file extension name will clue you in as to what is the appropriate program that can open the file. So for example, .mov is a QuickTime movie format and was developed for that application. Common video container formats include .avi, .mp4, and .mov, while common video codecs include H.264, MPEG-4, and DivX. The most efficient codec is HEVC or H.265. It is used to compress 8K UHD video. But because it requires a licensing fee, it is not compatible or supported by most devices or browsers. So the more common codecs for web are VP8 or VP9. The best video format depends on your need to balance video quality against the size of the video. Video is typically stored using lossy compression to keep file sizes as small as possible. We will delve into some of these formats next time. Presented by Designers Learn Code.